Hello, hello YouTube, how you guys doing? My name is Evie, and uh, today I've got something to show you guys. I've got the uh, Remington 77 by Crossman. See that there? Well, I'm using this other camera to show you guys over there. Air Master 77. Remington. I'm not sure what year this was made, but it's a BB pellet and it holds 200 reservoir BBs. Now you got to shake it and that gets some BBs in there. Once that's done, you put that down and ready to go. <clears throat> the way you load this is through the back, the bottom of the stock has the uh, receiver drop the BBs and that goes in here and then that goes right in there from here to there to there now this has a 4x15 scope and I'm not sure when it was made but now they have they remade it with the new Legacy 1000 innards. So this used to be 750, is a 10 pump pneumatic, 10, 10 pump pneumatic pump uh, gun. And uh, I'm not sure what year they started doing it, but recently I've seen them at Walmart. Now they're going with the new, with the new stocks. This had a pretty much the same thing as a 2100 and a 2200 and the mega 2200 magnum 2200 i think now i'll show you guys a 2200 later on which is basically the same size i believe it's 39 and three quarter inches and the barrel i believe is uh 20.88 inches now I think pretty much those are the same basic uh, things for the 22 and the 2100. But I'm going to show you guys what you can do with this Remington 77. You can take it apart, which was what I did, and you can polish the receiver now on the new ones you can't do that because nowadays they make them out of plastic but these old ones if you get your hands on an older one you can uh, you can polish out the receiver I'm, not I'm trying to show it to the other camera now, since I'm poor I'm using my old phone for the other camera I'll show you guys once I edit the video, we'll try to do that. But anyways, there are both guns. The polished out version and the non-polished out. Now we'll go out and shoot these for you. Now like I said, these shoot at around 750, 755. And the new ones, I believe, since they have the new innards of the Legacy 1000, they're shooting, well, they say they shoot at uh, 1000 FPS, but as we all know, uh, companies tend to exaggerate. That's if you're shooting with an alloy pellet, which none of us hardly ever do. So I figure we're, fi I don't have a, cr uh, a crony, so I figured with these older ones, we're shooting, since they say 750, well, another thing, these older ones pretty much were what they specified. So these probably are shooting around 750. So we'll see what happens. There you have it. I'll show you guys. We'll go out and shoot in a bit. There you go. Remember, I have a messed up shoulder. Oh, this is how you cock it. 
You bring this back. Ah, Jesus. This is how you cock it. Bring this back. Now, these are pretty stiff. And you put the pellet uh, right in there. Now you would go and you would pump it. I'm going to dry fire. You're not supposed to dry fire, but it's all good. One. Well, there you go, guys. Now we'll go out and shoot these. Hello, hello. Well, I'm back. Uh, we're going to shoot these... Uh, Remington 77s for you guys. Uh, we'll be shooting premieres. 0.177, 7 point grain, 7.4 grain. The pointed premieres. Now, what I like to do, I like to soak this thing in oil. Put it, put some of that spray. Uh, I'll tell you guys what it is later. Put it up on the things right here but uh what i do is i spray some oil on this that way it keeps your pellets well lubricated now we're gonna shoot way over yonder at the uh, targets that i made for you guys earlier but let's just see how far away that is so i'm gonna take a step from here one two three four five Now the reason I did that is because when I used to watch shooting videos on YouTube, I would see people posting that looked like really, really far away. I go, my backyard isn't big enough for that. But I figured out that it's all camera angles. So anyways, we're uh we're about 15 yards away from the target. And I'm gonna try to shoot for these, try to shoot this for you guys. Now remember my uh My shoulder is messed up, so if I can't pump this thing, well, leave it up to you. Remember, remember what I told you guys, you can load the BBs in there, load the BBs in there, you put, pull this back, you give it a shake upside down, that loads this with BBs and there you go. Now we're going to shoot a couple of BBs and we'll shoot a couple of pellets, okay? See if I can pump this for you guys. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. No idea where that went. I'm gonna go check. See if we're in the ballpark or not. <laughs> <laughs> 